hey, hey, what's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Forever Brandon TV, coming back to you guys with another video on Bruno Mars and his amazing nine track album. I know, right? Nine track album. I'm very, 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 very disappointed. For one, I'm not disappointed in the music. The music is great. I'm disappointed that it's nine tracks. Now, he ain't made an album since 2012, okay? I was expecting more, okay? At least a 15 to 16 track album, okay? Just a solid 15, 16, 17 track album. This man gave us nine tracks, okay? But I can see why. I can see why he did it, okay? He wanted to make it really tasteful, and these nine tracks are very, very tasteful, guys. 24. 4K Magic is his new album, guys. It's very, very classic. It gives you just a lot of... Uh, it just gives you hits from the... It's got an 80s, 90s flavor to it that I'm really, really loving, guys. It's giving me a little baby face. It's giving me a little new edition. It's giving me a little guy. It's giving me a little James Brown. It's giving me a little Michael Jackson. It's giving me a little baby... You know... Th damn, did I say baby face? Maybe I did. But it's just giving me all these 90s classics. It's giving me just, uh, uh, just everything. All the good soul music. It's giving me a little, uh, 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 kind of a little Luther Vandross. He's giving me everything on this album. Just this old school sound that I'm liking. This 20... This 24K Magic, guys, is amazing. Okay, get into it, get into it, get into it. So we got the first song. 24K Magic, okay. Uh, just amazing party song, guys. When you listen to it, it kind of gives you a little, uh, it sounds a little like, uh, oh, what's the name of that group? There's so many groups that made songs like this, but uh, it just kind of gives me a, a, just that 80s flavor, okay? When you listen to it, you kind of get a, a little a little tiny bit of a, a little run DMC, just that old school, doom, doom. You know, it just give me just that old school, and I really, really like it. Uh, so many, so many groups back in the '80s did songs like this. It's so hard to name them, but guys, I really, really like 24K Magic. I really like the video as well. I was, I was living for the video. It just got that old school flavor. Okay, uh, just that, just an old school flavor of, the, of an '80s video that I was really feeling. Chunky. Okay, he's basically talking about he want to see girls and Daisy Dukes dropping it low. You know, he a little freak, okay? Uh, I was definitely feeling it. I thought that it was a, uh, it just had a nice flow on it that I was really feeling. It just had a, a little 80s flavor that I was feeling on that as well. Perm, okay? Uh, 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 I think that I calm the girls down. The thing that I get the girls' life together is if they let their hair down and get a perm, okay? I was definitely feeling the message. Uh, uh, and I really like it that it gave me kind of a James Brown feel. Uh, when you listen to it, it just gives you like a, uh, da -da -da -da, da -da -da -da, you know, it just kind of give you that James Brown. That's what I like, okay? This song was very romantic. It just had a, a popping beat. It was, it gave you a little Michael Jackson kind of. A little tiny bit Michael Jackson, not a lot, but it, 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 the beat, this is probably one of my favorite songs because that beat was just kick ass for real, for real, for real. I definitely was feeling that song. Like, I was just grooving to it. I was just like, hey, nah. Listen to it. Versace on the floor. This gave me Babyface, Michael Jackson, New Edition, all at the same damn time. Just gave me everything I needed, okay? It, 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 just everything. Just that classic 90s. Baby fake sound. I just really, really liked it. It just, it's just amazing, guys. You will really like it. Straight up and down. When I tell you, this is just a, a, a classic 80s feel song that, in the little 90s too, that just gave me just that realness. I was definitely feeling that he did his damn thing. Calling all my lovelies. He was, uh, you know, this was giving me, uh, um, Seven, 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 nine, and three, eleven. Uh, uh, Morris Day kind of. This gave me a little Morris Day, a little tiny prince. Uh, just had just uh, a lot of just them, uh, you know, just just the, just just the heavies. It just had a little bit of the heavies in this. It even had a skit, a small skit in the song with Holly Berry guys, which I was I thought was very different. Uh, he just really put just a a, a a cool flavor with that one. Finesse. Okay, this gave me Bobby Brown. You know, this just gave me a Bobby Brown feel. When you listen to it, you just really get that Bobby Brown 
feel on the song. Too too good to say goodbye was just the last song of the album. Now, guys, I, I really really liked it. It was just an amazing, solid love song. That's just it's just talking about a love one that he just doesn't want to let go. And you know, he's in a he was in a relationship and he doesn't want to let this girl go. And I really like it. Guys, I expected more from Bruno Mars because he it's been it's been like two years since we haven't heard from him since his album uh his last album. Uh, that I really, really liked it, guys. And I just really expected a little bit more from uh, my boy Bruno Mars. Like, he could at least gave us more. I'm hoping that he make a deluxe version at least. He kept it a classic 90s. You know, in the 90s, kind of a little bit in the 90s, they used to always make nine-track albums. Albums, you know, nine-track lists of an album, you know, back then. But guys, uh, I was definitely feeling it. You will really love this album if you like that old school flavor. If you like a hint in the '90s flavor, if you like the '80s, this is the album for you. Check it out. It's on iTunes. You will really love it. Bam.